Hey y'all, I'm Shannon Thompson. I'm a strategic account executive at Amitros. Today I'll be answering the question, what happens when I exhaust my Medicare set-aside money? If your MSA runs out and you've exhausted your funds properly according to Medicare's guidelines, as well as reported on those funds properly, then Medicare steps in as the primary payer, and that is on future medical expenses related to your specific injury. If Medicare steps in to begin covering treatments related to your injury, you will be covered like any other Medicare beneficiary, and you'll be subject to corresponding co-pays, co-insurance, and deductibles. Medicare will only pay if you've previously enrolled in Medicare during an enrollment period, or if you've managed your MSA properly. If you do not manage your MSA funds properly or do not do the required reporting, you are jeopardizing your Medicare benefits. Medicare states will deny paying for treatments if it cannot track the proper use and exhaustion of the MSA funds. If your care is denied, you need to be able to replenish your MSA account for things that were unaccounted for, so reporting is correct to Medicare. You should also consider asking a professional administrator for help, perhaps even a Metro's. Until then, stay tuned for more frequently asked questions.